Hello everybody, today we're going to be taking a quick look at a box that is entirely a very good brand. The same brand. So, let's get right into it so I can show you what it is. And welcome back. Um, so today we have a reseller box. Now this was a reseller box um, that my wife got online from a consignment store. Um, so it was all, I think she knew the brand that was in it, but maybe didn't know. I, let's see, I have the invoice right here. So, okay, no, so this was, so it was a bundle. Um, but she didn't know everything that was in it, and she has um, how much she paid for it, which was, whew, that's, that's a bit much. <laughs> so this was, um, we did pay near full price, these were clearance, um, so, but it was still a little bit pricey, but I do know that one item has already sold, and there's already been interest in the other um, items, so... We should, we should, we should still, still turn a profit on this. All right, so without further ado, let me get right into what the brand is. Let me see if I can find the logo here um, so you can guess it real quick. Um, oh, hell. Let's show the tag. It'll be really obvious from the tag. Is that focusing? Yes, it is. This is entirely a Lululemon box and it's entirely Lululemon workout um, actually there's one there's there's two pairs of pants in here one pair of pants was not Lululemon they already sold of course um, I'll put a picture of those uh, somewhere and describe them uh, anyway this is entirely a Lululemon box so let's let's just stop my rambling and get right into it up first, we have a size four, um, which is roughly a small, um, and it's this uh, workout top. Um, all of these tops have the built-in sports bra, um, so a little bit confusing. Uh, I'm probably going to hold some of them up wrong. Um, here's this first piece. Um, and it is a size four. Uh, it's listed on the paper as a extra small. So, let me just, yeah. So, most of these are smalls or extra smalls. There is one large in here, and um, I will point that out when I get to it. All right, up next, we have the one pair of pants that is left in this box that hasn't sold. And as you see, it's a linen. Now, the, the paper says that this is a small, and based on how it fit on our mannequin, I can confirm that it is a small. Um, one of the great things about doing, I'll show off the pants a little bit more. One of the great things about doing all of these Lululemon just in a row is that I really got a feel for the sizing of Lululemon. So I know that a four is an extra small. I know exactly how, I know that, exactly how it's going to feel when it goes on the mannequin and so when i got other lululemon items from other um resellers that were you know not didn't have the size uh, that the tag had come out which actually seems to happen quite a bit with lululemon i think because it's all workout gear so people take the tags out because it just make them a little bit more comfortable but anyway i was able to very easily tell this is a small, this is a large, this is a medium. So yeah, I have a good feel for Lululemon sizing now. I'm learning. All right, up next we have another workout top. Um, now, these are really difficult to hold up because the, the built-in sports bra just kind of wants to hang out. And I know, yeah, this isn't, this isn't right, but get a good enough feel for this um yeah so this one was a oh 
this was the one that didn't have the size. But again, because I was measuring it, or because I was putting it on the mannequin and shooting it, I know that this was a small. So probably about a size six, maybe? I don't know. I don't know what the number is on that, but I do know that the, uh, I do know that small. Small works. And is this, yeah, there we go. This is, there. That's how it's supposed to go. Well, that looks a lot nicer. All right. All right, this is the one piece that is large. Um, it also did not have a tag. There you go. Now this one's a little bit different from the other pieces because the built-in, uh, it's not really so much a built-in sports bra on this one as much as it's just a uh, kind of a shelf, a um, little extra padding shelf. Um, but it's same style of workout, uh, workout top. So we've had, um, we have had a lot of interest in these already. Um, I know my wife has already had people asking for measurements and um, normally normally when something when someone asks for measurements there's like a 50 percent chance that they're going to buy it it's just a matter of um if the measurements come in the way they hoped and if the um and if the price can be worked out which we're pretty we're pretty generous with our pricing so that's never really an issue all right up next we have another workout top um this one i believe is a yeah this one's a small um, and it's the same style with the built-in sports brawl and the kind of tank top on the outside. Um, so, yeah. And surprisingly, I actually folded that one to keep it relatively uh, how it's supposed to be in the box. All right, and the last item in here is, you're not going to be surprised, another workout top with the built-in sports brawl. Well, this is kind of that other style that has the built-in shelf, but same, basically same thing. <laughs> and this one is also a small. So you see, in case you're wondering, there's the Lulu logo, the, the Lulu Lemon logo on the back. Ugh. All right, so um, that's everything in this box. Now, like I said, um, already already sold one item from this box which i will show right here um this was the a what was it a l o elmo elmo no because there's no in all 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 o all o there we go i forgot what the brand was but uh these were a pair of workout pants um they did have the open lacing on the side, which I probably, I'm doing that to a picture. <laughs> my, my hand would be behind that. Um, so they sold right away. Like they sold, we listed next day. So the one, the, and of course they're the one item that was not Lululemon. Um, you know, I think the market might be just a tad saturated for Lululemon, but most of the pieces of Lululemon we've had eventually have sold and they have sold at full price. So I'm not too worried about making a profit off this box. And as I said um, many, many moons ago, we did want to try a lot of new things. Uh, we wanted to really diversify some of our sourcing um, just to see what works, what doesn't work, get a nice feel for everything uh, this year. All right. So if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, share, subscribe, and comment. All that stuff's below. You know how to use YouTube, so I don't need to tell you. Until next time, I've been Charles, and I'll see you.